With a 30-minute time limit, Green Bay, Wisconsin, weighing 248 pounds, Dick the Bruiser. His opponent on this side of the ring, from Kansas City, Kansas, weighing 240 pounds, Bob Orton. And the referee, Fred Lederborg. Hi, everybody. The slinky-looking guy with the crew cut, the big one is Bob Orton. The little big one is Dick the Bruiser, or Dick Atlas. Their kids. Horton wants to know why he's so tall. Well, he just grew that way, Bob. That's all. Yeah, okay, okay. I won't gouge his eyes out until at least five minutes. This is a funny match because the crowd hates both of these guys. No, you can't shake him down. Dick the Bruiser always starts in by trying to shake the ring down. So here we go. Big old mean Bob Orton. Then big old mean Dick the Bruiser. Oh, rough, he says. Orton's father, you know, was a wrestler before him. Orton won't hit him with his fist, either. There's a wrist lock. Stay in the picture, fellas. Don't run away. This we like. Take down. with this wrist lock. Watch his shoulders are nine inches off of the mat. What are you talking about? Oh, what a pretty one. <laughs> Bruiser says, is this fair? Watch that knee. Of course, 
is directly behind Mr. Lederbrook. Bird, brawl, whatever you want to call it. Fred is his name. He's been refereeing matches here in Illinois for well ever since the year one. Hey, hey, watch it, Fred. I'm gonna get with the crowd. In the Raymond here. Turner. Raymond Turner, please report to the west door. Raymond Turner. Raymond Turner probably left his motor running. It's all right for Atlas to uh, keep his knee up like that, but he sometimes misplaces it and gets it on the esophagus. choking, you can bank on that. As much as they dislike Orton, they, they dislike Dick the Bruiser more. Oh, fine. commission rules at the count of three when a hold is illegal. Dick, I have a pair of uh, pliers down there in the toolbox if it'll help you. They, we're going to need them to get him apart. Flying mare and a choke. Anything to rough up an opponent's head. I'm going to keep this up until he gets Orton hot and real mad here. See what he did? He kicked him right under the heart. seen Orton afraid of anyone and he can soak up an amazing amount of punishment and still come back strong. So don't feel too sorry for him yet. This is a reverse headlock but the way Atlas uses it, it uh, turns out quite often to be a chokehold first class. mare there on the count of two. Seems like Bruiser's just bound and determined that Orton used the C&I dog, doesn't it? Why should he? kick his head off like a football. That's for you. on each other there. They look like a pair of Jersey Bulls in spring, don't they? Oh, great. I'm all for you, Orton. Don't ordinarily like you. <laughs> Give him two or 
number three on the cauliflower, kid. That's just a little more than bruisers can take. This big kid can hit you like a sledgehammer. as you folks may suppose, are not on the chin, but they're actually on the breastbone. Right up where your collarbones hook onto your gizzard bone, and if you think it doesn't hurt, just get hit there once. An elbow lock and a takedown by the ear. And here we go again, depriving Mr. Orton of his oxygen. And look, lady, I don't think anything bad will happen. The little gal across the ring there, she won't even look. chin and arm lock posted. Body press that Bruiser has at the moment. Oh, now you're making like the thinker, you stinker. What are you trying to do? Find his spleen? Get an elbow like that with all that weight right in your ribs, soft part of your tummy. That can hurt. Those licks in the kidneys don't do you any good either. You become a great customer of Carter. Come on, get loose from there, Atlas. Naughty boy, mustn't choke. permission.
toe hold. Knee lift into the face and another. He's got this big old boy just. Uh oh. Wild driver. He can't let go of him. Start a pile driver. We'll see what it's called. Come on, Marquise. We're running out of time here, boy. And upside down, bear hug in 13 minutes and 47 seconds. The winner of the fall and the match, Dick the Bruiser. So you've got it. An upside down bear hug. Russ Davis at ringside. Hope you liked it.